Apple has about, what, $210 billion in cash. So why is it borrowing yet more money? You may well ask. But Apple's not alone. A host of blue-chip companies are jumping on the cheap money bandwagon and borrowing by the billion. Just on Tuesday, big-name companies borrowed, in one day, a total of $27 billion. And that was followed by a borrowing binge on Wednesday. Disney, Deer, Coca-Cola, Anthem, they all issued bonds. In other words, they all borrowed money. What is going on? That's easy to explain. Money's as cheap as it's been in years because of interest rates. That's the cost of borrowing. They've sunk to historic lows. So why not replace your old high-rate debt with new cheap debt? It's called refinancing. Homeowners do it, and now corporations are doing it. Virtually free money is very attractive, even if you're flush to start with. So what's the result of all of this? Well, first of all, these big companies can reduce the cost of their debt. That should help their profits now and their expansion plans for the future. And it will also pull yet more money into America. In Europe, you get no interest. You don't even get all your money back when you make a loan. Of course, you're going to look for some place that's safe and pays at least some interest. And that's us, America. You don't think investors will scramble to lend money to super safe Apple and get a near 3% return? Now, it is unusual to have a strong economy and very cheap money all at the same time. But here it is. It is now. And just look at those blue-chip American companies jump in quick and suck the money in from all around the world. It's a good thing.